Hi, my name is Jim Scrivener, Manager of Product Marketing with Extron Electronics, and I'm here to introduce the XTP Crosspoint Systems. XTP Crosspoint Systems are multi-format switching and management control over AV devices within a system. They allow that capability for both locally connected devices and remotely connected devices within the system. The heart of the system itself is the XTP Crosspoint Matrix, which is available in two sizes. You can build systems up to 16 by 16 and up to 32 by 32 using a variety of uh, input and output boards for the system. You'll notice that we have a number of different boards that accommodate different video formats within a system. HDMI input boards, DVI input boards, 15-pin input boards, which are universal in nature and can accept high-resolution RGB HV signals, as well as standard definition um, composite video types of signals. Any type of analog signal that comes into the device is digitized for streamlined switching throughout the system. A number of output boards are available as well, HDMI output, DVI output, and what we call X XTP CP boards, both on output and input types, which allow for extended transmission of videos to source locations and destination locations. Stepping back a little bit, you'll see some of the transmitters featured here. Again, the transmitters allow you to accommodate multiple video types of formats. For example, an HDMI transmitter and also a 15-pin transmitter that is also compatible with RGBHV and standard definition signals. I mentioned earlier that all signals are digitized. Our standard definition signals, we apply what we call SD Pro processing to deinterlace incoming 480i signals, for example, to a 480p progressive type of format. This really simplifies switching and establishes a high amount of reliability within the system. The form factors of these products are very small, so they're conveniently mounted under tables or for the receivers behind flat paneled displays. But we also have a couple of other unique models that allow for convenient input into wall, for example. There's a, a couple of different wall mount uh, decor style transmitters, which allow acceptance of uh, digital video as well as analog video signals within a system. Provides a lot of convenience at auxiliary locations for laptop presenters to come up with their device, but you don't happen to know what type of video format needs to be supported. Another transmitter here is our three input switching transmitter, the XTP USW Universal uh, transmitter. Features two HDMI inputs and a 15 pin input as well. This is ideally partnered with a cable cubby furniture mount type of product for that conference room application where again you have multiple input devices of varying signal formats. Over here with the receivers, we have a couple different models receivers. One is a scaling version which allows multiple formats that are coming into the signal or into the system rather to be converted to one single common output resolution for reliable display onto the various displays within the system. Now connectivity from the, the boards of the matrix switcher to the remote endpoints is achieved on one single CAT5 cable. On one cable we can transmit digital video digital audio, bi-directional IR control, bi-directional RS-232 control, Ethernet, and remote power. The matrix itself, the matrix switcher itself, can power all of the endpoints within the system, basically eliminating the requirement for power supplies, again, behind those flat panel displays. So a lot of flexibility as far as installation goes. CAT5 cable is widely available. It's economical, easy to terminate. Just standard off-the-shelf type CAT5 cable can be used with the system. Now that we have explained the different devices within the system, I wanted to talk about some of the comprehensive control capabilities that we offer. For example, Ethernet insertion of RS-232 signals enables a centralized location for control to be distributed out through the entire system. Examples of that is an issuance of a command, say, to one of the input transmitters to switch between inputs. On the output side, I could just as easily um, switch a display on and off with RS-232 commands that can go through the system out to the attached display device. Bidirectional RS-232 and IR insertion enables direct insertion onto the XTP-CP boards 
for again expanded distribution out to all the all of the uh, remote endpoints within the system. Here's a couple of examples. I can issue an IR command through my control processor, which is wired to one of my input ports. That signal goes out through the single Cat5 cable all the way up to a Blu-ray player, which may be in the system for uh, powering on or off of the system. An RS-232 command can equally be sent hardwired into one of the output boards and passed on out to the display for powering on and off or switching between inputs if I had that need. Again, a lot of flexibility um, with the control aspect of the XTP crosspoint switchers. Ethernet extension is another unique feature that allows us to take uh, wired connections from Ethernet switches which may be uh, residing within a rack, for example. And I could again go out to source locations or destination, um, output destinations with that, those wired switches. The flexibility of this system allows incorporation of a couple of, you could use multiple LANs within the system. For example, there might be a house LAN which passes out Ethernet connection to devices. An example of that would be something that's passed through the system to a Blu-ray player for firmware updates, things of those nature, or just an Ethernet connection point itself for the presenter that happens to come up with need to plug into the, uh, the network of the, the company itself. AV control LANs are also utilized for device control. So the flexibility of this approach allows us to also uh, extend control capabilities through Ethernet to um, certain destination locations. Now we haven't forgotten audio management within this system. A number of um, features such as audio embedding, audio de-embedding, and audio downmixing of multi-channel signals is available throughout a number of the different devices that we just talked about. We also have output boards that give you local analog output capability for direct connection into the audio processing system, the amplifiers and such, which may reside within uh, local proximity. Now the reliability of this system is Extron quality that you've uh, come to expect from Extron products. We've incorporated a number of Extron exclusive technologies such as Eated Minder and Key Minder for comprehensive uh, management of all devices within a system. Also, speed switch technology allows for ultra-fast switching of HDCP encrypted content within the system. Here's an example. We have a PC which happens to be showing our intuitive software control program for XTP, but these two displays are both showing PC inputs. What I'm going to do through the control system is switch a Blu-ray player to the output and you can see how quick the switching takes place with those types of devices. Just one more example. And you can see how, how high performance speed switch technology delivers within the system. Thank you very much for your time. If you'd like to find out additional information on XTP crosspoint systems, please visit www.extron.com. Thank you.